Welcome everyone. Hey, my name is Eugene and this is my little bitty cooking show for you to eat. And uh, I am all about whole foods, plant-based cooking. Oh, and uh, doctor's orders, no oils. I bet I got something good for you. And if you want to adopt a healthier way of eating, come on in, check it out. Yeah, buddy, take a look at this right here. Pumpkin pie, whole foods, plant-based, no oils, no dairy, no bait, too. So, first thing we got to do, we're going to make us some pie crust. I like to use a date nut crust. We're going to throw in some cacao nibs. What I'm doing here is, uh, as well, hey, don't forget, we'll have the menu. Click on the link down below. you got a printable menu. All right, so just pay attention. Oh, about a dozen dates. Chop them up with the kitchen shears. Make sure you don't have any of the pits in there. Otherwise, you're going to have a lot of fiber in your uh, in your crust here, okay? And i got two palmfuls of macadamia nuts. Substitute the nut of your choice. you got pecans. you got walnuts. you got all that stuff. All right, some cacao nibs. Look at that. Got me a nice little palm full there. And look, look, just a little pinch extra, okay? And about a tablespoon or so of cane syrup or syrup, as my daddy would call it, uh, molasses, maple, whatever you want to put in there. Hey, and if you want, throw you some pumpkin pie spice, a little dash of nutmeg, maybe just a little touch of cinnamon. Throw it all in your food processor. Let's get it all crunched up a bit. Now, hey, yeah, now this isn't just bourbon whiskey. It's bourbon whiskey with some vanilla beans in it, so it's a bourbon vanilla. Gives it that little extra something in there, huh? All right, get it all processed up nice and fine. I like it a little rustic with all those dates in there and that little bit of cane syrup whatever it's going to be nice and sticky icky go ahead and just you know like you're making mud pies smoosh it on down in your pie pan get all the coverage you want and hey now we're ready to talk filling okay all right got us a can of pumpkin i'm putting a half cup of nut milk in there and then mix it up and take a look at it you still want it a little bit thick and we're going to add a little bit of bourbon vanilla in here too okay this is going to be an ice box pie throw you a little sweetener in there like i said you can use you some cane syrup you can use you some molasses jaggery you know whatever hey what we want we want something that's going to be that isn't going to be processed that's going to be natural Pumpkin pie spice, dash of nutmeg, a little bit of cinnamon, cinnamon, cinnamon in there. Okay, now hey, if I had my wire whisk around, I'd have used that to mix this thing up here. But, uh, well, and hey, and a dash of ginger, and there we go. We got our bourbon vanilla. Put you about a dozen vanilla beans in your bourbon there. There's check on my videos there, on my channel there. I'll show you how you make it. It's real simple. All right, like I said, now if I had my uh, my wire whisk, I'd be mixing it with that. But you know what? I had this spatula. It works. Give it a good mix. Now, hey, you want to be sure and put some of that bourbon in there. Put a little bit of alcohol in it because what you're going to do is you're going to throw this thing in the freezer. We're not going to be baking it. Give it a good mix, and then, hey, you know what time it is. Let's throw it in the pie pan. Oh, wait a minute. You know what time it was supposed to be? I was supposed to put some chia seeds in it, and I forgot. Hey, this isn't rocket surgery or brain science. Ain't no big deal. Throw your chia seeds in there, too, and just moosh it all up. Get it all worked around. There you go. You got you a nice pie looking thing. You're going to throw it in the freezer for about one hour. Let it set up a little bit. Then take it out for just a little bit, maybe at least 15 minutes. And it's going to cut perfect. And you're going to serve it up good. Now here's the ingredients. You can go ahead and pause the video if you want. Take notes. Click the link down below. Hey, if you like my video, I appreciate it. 
click subscribe, give me a thumbs up, post me on your Facebook or whatever. I hope you enjoy this. Hey, if you got any uh, ideas or if you tried it on your own, you got any uh, recommendations on something you'd like for me to do, leave it in the comment section below. I'm so glad that you took the time to watch my video. I want to thank each and every one of you. Thanks for watching. Bye now. Y'all come back now, you hear?